I buy perfumes, use them, and when they are finished, I find it hard to let go of the bottle. Am I okay? Do I need help? Am I the only one? Is something wrong with me? It's a serious concern because tell me why this, this is it. Tell me why I've used this bottle. Finished. Now, another one. Yeah? That's two. Another one. Can you see? Three. Another one. Can you see? Another one. Huh? This is Prada. Uh, and you said clearly. Okay, let me turn it this way. You see? This is another one. Finished. Another one. Oh God, another one. The list is endless. Am I okay? I think I should this one. Then this one. Yeah. I can't throw them away. Like I, I have all those bottles. Like I have them, and I'm wondering why am I keeping them? What am I using them for? Do I want to sell the empty bottles? Can I sell the empty bottles? I don't know but it doesn't it doesn't look normal like i find it hard to just let them go i just want to keep seeing them on the shelf i don't want to throw them away i feel like a part of me is leaving me i just want to see them every day you know but it's just occupying space and it's not just my bottles of perfume it's tote bags um, um packaging bags um it could be anything i just find it hard to let these things go i just keep piling them Calling them and I'm like, yo, I'm, I think I need help. Yeah, let me know if you actually go through this. Let me know if you go through this. I want to know. I want to. I want to believe that I am not alone. If I am not alone, let me know in the comment section. If you are the type that keeps your empty bottles, you know, in your shelf or in your wardrobe or wherever you keep your bottles of perfume. Um, the thing is, I I love perfumes. I love I love buying perfumes. I I can literally spend my last dime on a bottle of perfume. Like, I love to smell good all the time, right? And when people say, what do you want me to buy for you? The first thing I tell them is perfume. Like, I particularly love this hypnotic poison. There's something about it. When you use it, it's just so, I don't know, classy. The, 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 the fragrance is not, you know, harsh and hard. It's soft and feminine. And then I particularly love this one as well. Like, ooh, I want to get this one again. That's um, that's Cisco Rodriguez for her. I want to get it again. Um, Hypnotic Poison by Jill. A must buy. You know. Um, oh, Gucci intense oud. <laughs> a must buy. I highly recommend this perfume if you if you have used them or tried them. Oh, and I love this Alexa Roja. Ooh, like when I wear them, like. It smell good. It smell like money. It smell like money. Like Dima Mel always say, smell like money. <laughs> but I think I need to find a way to let go of these bottles. I'm too attached to these perfumes. And I don't know why. What do I do? I need you to you know, advise me. Let me know what, what I should do. Should I just one day close my eyes and just throw them away in the bin and move on? But it's hard okay anyway tell me what is your favorite perfume at the moment recommend let me know so i can get them um for now i i'm just using like a lot of other you know brands like oriflame and um yeah so i'm using at the moment this the economy is not economy right now so <laughs> we're trying to you know manage but anyway the, the, the essence of this video is to tell you that i have a problem with letting go of my empty bottles of let me know if I'm, a, I'm not alone in the comment section, right? Okay, thank you for watching. I love you all. Mwah. <laughs>